In this demo, we will create an integration between the Telegram chat box and the application developed on the 1C Enterprise platform. We made a new chatbot. Then we will write several messages in the messenger for our chatbot and then read these messages in our 1C application. Say hello to our bot and send it to 1C. Here we use the processing we developed with the two commands read and post to telegram. Also here we recorded token in advance which we received when creating the bot. Please note that the token is confidential information. Knowing it, you can completely take control of your bot. Let's now read what we wrote to our bot. We press the button to read the Telegram bot. Our system downloaded the correspondence with the bot. We also see the name of the sender, its ID, and the message itself. We will need ID chat in order to send something back to our bot. We will write something in response. Using ID chat, we can see our message in Telegram. Push the post to Telegram. Cool! Let's try it again. As we see, this mechanism works. Thus, it is possible to make a simple integration of the 1C system with a chatbot. Now we will demonstrate how to implement this integration for an application developed on the 1C enterprise platform. First create an external data processing in the designer mode. Give a name and create a new form. In order to independently set the appearance of the form, Disable the autofill flag. Next, we will create our attributes, which will need to be displayed in our form. These will be simple text attributes, chat ID, token, and some message field. Then on the commands tab, add the commands with which we will exchange with our bot, read bot telegram, and post to telegram. Then just drag and drop our commands onto the form, and for a better view, the type of our text field, some text. Also drag and drop our commands, which will automatically appear on our form in the form of buttons. We just need to slightly improve the appearance, which we will do with the help of groupings of form elements. It is time to write some code for messaging with our bot. To do this, we create a procedure that will be executed on the client application side. Next, we will create a connection to the Telegram API. We will register the connection parameters with our connection and receiver response. We will use the readjson method built into our 1C platform. Well, then through the loop we display all text messages in our dialog form. For a more convenient reading of the text, we set the format through the use of a template. Now similarly, we will create a procedure for processing and the sending of a message from 1C to Telegram. The execution of the command will also occur on the client application side. 
work with the connection is performed similarly to the previous example. That's it. Our messaging processing with the bot is ready. We can create a bot and start communicating with it from the 1C application. Next time, we will show you how this can be used for real business tasks of the company.